all right my people welcome back onto this channel well thanks so much for subscribing our prayer has been that the good lord will continue to support you all in all your endeavors as you keep supporting us on this channel we'll say very big amen to that well my people congratulations to chief sunday hmm. well on to this one these are very great news i know a lot of enemies of progress will be you know thinking in different direction but the truth of the matter is forward ever backward never for yoruba nation movement well onto this one hmm, there's been a lot of no congratulatory messages from everyone out there hmm, as chief sunday igboho backs doctorate degree from triune biblical university usa <laughs> all right my people the news in details well, onto this, the Yoruba Nation Agitator Sunday at the year more popularly known as Sunday Igbo on Tuesday unveiled photographs where he backed a honorary degree from the Triune Biblical University, United States of America, and then was awarded the degree in Republic of Benin where he resides. The photographs of him in academic gown and um, the certificate were sent to me, according to the spokesperson of the Ilana, Omar Odua, led by Professor Banji Akintoye. Mr. Maswell Adeleye, through my WhatsApp platform on Tuesday evening. All right, and then on to this according to the certificate of the award sunday adeyemo was said to have bagged honorary doctorate in peace and then security management slash international relations with specialization in wars slash conflict and then peace studies from the said university the certificate which was issued on Tuesday, November 1st, was signed by both the president of the university and the vice chancellor and was given to Adeyemo as a honorary degree. He posted in the academic gown and then took pictures with the leader of the Ilana Omo Udua, Professor Banji Akintoye, as well as some other Yoruba citizens living in Benin Republic. All right, my people, I think this is a very great, you no know, congratulatory message to Chief Sunday Igbo. Well, forward ever, backward never. And then, well, according to, you no, know, a lot of people do have reacted in different forms. Hmm. Well, and then, you know, a lot of people will tell you that what is exactly the problem, what's going on, well, with the urban nation movement. Some are, like, you no know, so happy with it, and some are, like, what is happening, Seth? Well, Igbo Wo Osha, congratulations, Oya Morio. That means he will not be turning to cart again, according to Ali De Edi. Well, I don't understand what he meant by that. As alleged by some people, congrats and please let us Christianity be let your christianity be real hmm. well my people a lot of people have actually reacted in different forms but one thing i understand for sure is that no good thing will definitely come that easy this is a very good thing but a lot of people want to attribute different things to that i can i can get a lot of messages that i don't actually want to read but some set of people have been like pilado please try and read read them so that we know how to tackle all our enemies well i think i'm going to chip in some well let me take some then i go to others well according to bado manian he said nigeria doesn't like truth mr nam the canon is in detention because of peace in nigeria mr sunday tried to proclaim peace in nigeria but people do not want him sheikh ahmad gumi the nigerian cleric who negotiates with bandits was there well, their relation was there, relation himself, and then uh, we want Nigeria to be great country. Okay, well, that had been said by that. Well, according to Izobeha, 
this one is another it's a is a very strong one where well, a lot of people need to hear this he said why are these people deceiving themselves someone who cannot even speak what they call broken english is getting a phd is that how academic reduced to nothing we as why are some nigerians promoting illiteracy so he has automatically becomes a pastor because the award is coming from a bible school tomorrow Iboho will start preaching and then interpreting the bible now wow all right well <laughs> this one is another strong one coming from someone but one thing i a, a lot of people need to understand onto this aspect you getting a western education in the first place you no know, talking about the western education we have now got you know, to understand that this so-called western education you people are preaching it is not it is not our own education yes it's a borrowed language it's a borrowed education and then when we talk about the real education i think that yoruba language is the real education because when you know it very well you understand it very well you are able to interact with a lot of people everywhere at you no know, at any given time you can bring peace to the land i think that's the major <laughs> education we talk about so it must not be the you know the education coming from the western world because we are colonized and then as far as what had been happening it has also been gathered that nigeria is not even a country it's not our country it's not anyone's country in fact nigeria is not a nation it's just you know, a gathering of different people coming together when you cannot speak one language in the first place, my brother, my sister, we don't understand ourselves. Hmm, forget it. It's not a country. So while we're talking about a nation right now, we're talking about Yoruba nation. And the Yoruba nation, what language do they speak? What do they understand together? Their education, I think right now as we speak, as far as everything is going right now, nothing is happening in the whole world right now there's nothing like you attributing the western you no know, education as the best compared to every other region like as it stands right now the yoruba nation movement as soon as yoruba nation is being declared i think they will have their own studies and the way you are able to graduate from that then you are a graduate you are a learned person in that field in your area in your country in your zone and then in case you don't know Somebody like Chief Sunday Bowo would also, would also be one of the lecturers in Yoruba land if it comes to let us teach Yoruba language. So I think everybody needs to get this right now because the level to which the whole world is going right now hmm, is not it's not to be compared to what you know, we you know we would be talking about as soon as the the Yoruba nation is achieved. So anyone who is coming out to say, oh, someone who cannot read that, right? Who so do you? Have you met him one-on-one? -on -one? I think everybody needs to be very careful in whatever they say right now. Well, as far as the Yoruba language is concerned, Chief Sunday Igboho is a graduate in Yoruba land. So we cannot say more than that. Well, the truth of the matter is a lot of people are happy with the movement. Congratulations to Chief Sunday Igboho and uh, you know, and the rest of the people who are actually working with him. Well, I think it's a very good one. It's a great news. Hmm, that is serious. Well, my people, this is another one reaching us right now. What more can we say? Well, let me have your own take on this and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are new on this channel. All right. Thanks and God bless.